One quick thing I want to cover is that for whatever code editor you are going to use to edit Terraform stuff, you should try to see if there's a plugin available for Terraform. So I'm in PHP Storm here because I write PHP a lot, and all the products created by JetBrains has really good support for Terraform. So does Sublime Text, so does VS Code. You'll be covered in any common editor that you might use. So if I go to settings here and check out plugins, you'll see I have a HashiCorp Terraform HCL plugin. So this is Terraform and HCL. So HCL is HashiCorp configuration language. It's a JSON-like syntax that HashiCorp has created that you might use in a lot of HashiCorp products like Packer, Terraform, and so on. I already have this installed, so I'm just going to go ahead and hit OK here. And we'll see that this is going to give me a lot of abilities like command clicking into resources and seeing where they're defined, along with auto completion and other neat features, um, which I really suggest you do because it's very, very handy for this type of thing. It really saves you a lot of time instead of digging through files. Again, this will be available in whatever common editors you use, VS Code, Sublime Text, PHP Storm, and anything else uh, JetBrains makes. So that's it. Just a quick tip. After this video, we're going to get started and actually use Terraform.